Hello my YouTube family, you found being Dusty May. I am bringing you a quick Easter haul video because a lot of people have been asking about a good way to do Easter with a child with special needs and alternatives to chocolate for anybody that's say tube fed or for any other reason doesn't eat food or even just for other kids they don't always need chocolate at Easter so for this haul I wanted to keep it pretty much on the cheap as you know there's no point spending a lot for something like this especially because you know it's the equivalent to buying chocolate I sort of try and keep it equal for the kids as Elwood does get some chocolate so I try and spend about the same on both of them um, both of the kids always get pajamas at Easter time that's a pretty traditional thing I found this onesie for Dusty and it's really soft that's a bit of a must with um, clothes for Dusty is that they must be soft this one was at Target and it's got press studs uh, down the front there and for her we will put this on her backwards so that she can't take her nappy off at night time so that is her pajamas and then the rest I think except oh, one other thing this handmade Easter soap um, which has a little bunny rabbit on top um, so I bought that one from Apicali, which I've mentioned in other videos in the past. They're a cloth nappy store here in Brisbane. Um, but yeah, the rest has all been a Daiso haul. Um, so I started off with this basket just to put everything in. And I tried to find some ways I'd be able to package that up and got these dissolvable little heart shaped spongies. They're really cute. Dusty likes we throw these in water and they do just dissolve down to nothing and Dusty likes watching that. Um, and then just some pretty cellophane to bundle it all up. And then the rest has just been anything that I think she might find fun. So this is a pen with a really fluffy pom-pom on it and she loves drawing so she will love that. Um, the next thing is really sensory. She's got some makeup brushes here they've got Mickey Mouse on them and um, she likes copying me doing my makeup so that's really nice they're going to be really fluffy found a very cute little teddy bear hair tie she's just getting used to having her hair tied up at the moment we're sort of working on that um, got some stickers she loves peeling and sticking stickers on things and peeling them off again so a bit of a unicorn theme at the moment. She's a bit unicorn obsessed. Then next I found this really cute wind up hopping chicken. Uh, we've got a squeezy egg. Um, that one's a bit disturbing, I think. It's like got a, what well, looks like a chicken embryo in there. I don't know, but it's squeezy. So hopefully she'll like it. You never know. Um, all these things were only a couple of dollars. Um, this is a one of these beautiful visual stims. It's one of these water and oil things. I'm not even sure what you'd call them, a bit like an hourglass, but they're really enjoyable and calming to watch. Um, so there we go. Yeah, so she'll really like that. Um, this is like a little mini blankie. So not even sure if she'll take to it or not but just thought it was really cute because it's a little pink bunny we have a pink shower cap that's really cute so most of this stuff has been like bath and toiletry themed this time and then a little bunny rabbit bath sponge so by the time i bundle this all up as you can see most of it fits sort of in the basket like this and we'll chuck on the soap and pajamas and then all these should make a really cute Easter present. Um, just to give a comparison, uh, Elwood has vegan Easter egg, mini vegan Easter eggs and Mario pajamas. So both of them I've spent 
roughly the same amount on about $50 for their Easter, which is what I usually cap Easter presents at for the kids each year. So I hope this video has helped with a few ideas if you weren't sure um, how to put together a good little Easter bundle for anybody that you know you don't necessarily want to buy food for or they might have medical condition that they can't eat. Um, so we've basically done this every year now for Dusty and she's always enjoyed just a mixture of random things. Um, yeah, so I hope you liked it. See ya. Is it Daisy Dez or Daisy? Oh, no, I was just doing your order for it. Well, I don't know. I'm making it up. Dezo, you call it well, it's D A I S O. That's like da Dizo. Dizo. Uh, I don't know. Just taking I don't know what it's called. I would never have gone in there if it wasn't you. I know. I go all the great places. <laughs> all right. I think that's good. Do you think that's good? That's enough. Did you? Yeah, 50 bucks I spent on her.